So in the event of a power outage, what's gonna to happen to your solar system? We all know how annoying power outages can be, and unfortunately, they're becoming more common. This winter, it's forecast that there'll be rolling outages across the country as demand is set to outstrip supply. There are many supply constraints around the country, which will lead to more power cuts in the future. So what happens when the grid goes down and you have a solar system? Well, that depends on what type of system you have. A common misconception is that a solar only system will stay up and running in a grid outage. However, if a grid goes down, your solar only system will stop working. That might sound annoying, but it's for two reasons, safety and technology in the inverter. If your system's producing power in an outage, there is a risk that it could send power back to the grid and electrocute people working on the lines. That's why your solar system's smart enough to detect when the grid goes down and automatically turn itself off. Once the grid is up and running again, your inverter will kick back into gear and start producing power. The good news is you don't have to worry about the power going out if you have a battery as part of your system. In the event of an outage, a battery like the Tesla Powerwall will switch to off-grid instantly. Your Powerwall basically acts like the grid to keep your solar running and your home powered. Thanks to the technology built into the battery, it's able to disconnect itself from the grid, removing any risk to linesmen working on repairs. Additionally, it will then function as the grid to keep your solar running and your home powered. When the power goes out, you'll receive an alert in your Powerwall app. Usually the changeover is so fast, you won't even know that this has occurred. The app will display your estimated remaining battery time. This is based on your current loads and how full your battery is. The Powerwall also has a feature called Stormwatch. If a major storm is forecasted, your Powerwall will automatically fully charge in anticipation for the storm in case there's an outage. During installation, we're able to separate essential and non-essential circuits so that the non-essential turn off in an outage. However, you'll still need to be mindful of how much power you're using. For example, you may want to leave cooking that roast dinner for another night. This isn't so important if the sun is out and your solar is cranking, but if it's nighttime with a potentially long outage, it's essential to manage your loads. When the grid is back, your system will automatically switch from off-grid mode to grid tied, bringing your full system back online. So let's look at an example of how a home with a battery operated in a five hour power cut last winter. The power went out at 5.30 p.m. and the customers received an alert on the Tesla Powerwall app. Their Powerwall was at a comfortable 98% charge, offering approximately 11 hours of backup power despite a draw of 1.6 kilowatts. As the power went out just as the sun and solar production was dropping, they would need to manage their power usage to get through the night. Checking back in at 7 p.m., they had minimized their electricity consumption to 0.3 kilowatts, significantly extending the Powerwall's backup duration to over 24 hours, easily getting them through the night. A subsequent check just before 9 p.m., when they knew they were using a bit more electricity, they could again see in real time how much power they were using and how many backup hours were remaining. In this situation, grid power came back on shortly after 9 p.m. and the homeowners were able to use their usual three hours of power that night to recharge their battery. This example shows you how easy it is to monitor your battery during an outage to ensure you get through the night with the lights on. Overall, it's important you understand the limitations of your solar system and what you can expect during an outage. If having protection when the grid goes down is important to you, then we recommend a battery as part of your setup. However, if this protection isn't a priority for you, then solar only could be the way to go. So whether it's battery or solar only, as part of our service, we'll help guide you through choosing the system that suits you best.